just another beautiful day in Hawaii, riding electric unicycles and one wheels. All right, this is just beautiful. They call this Disneyland. And the reason why they call this ride Disneyland is because you just have smiles on your faces all day. And unfortunately, we forgot to bring Evie some safety gear. She's just gonna take it easy today. I love it with the ocean, <laughs> the trees. The this is so beautiful. I love this, really. this is amazing. Remember when you were a kid looking forward to presents on Christmas or on your birthday and time couldn't move fast enough? As a kid, I always wished for time to move faster so I could open gifts, get my driver's license, finish with school, or get that job promotion. But now that I'm older, time is moving too fast as I catch myself saying cliche phrases like, time flies, and where has the time gone? As I celebrate my birthday, now in my mid-40s, I can't help but reflect that even if I outlive the average human lifespan, at this point, I'm more than halfway to death. So, with my life more than halfway over, why do I choose to spend my time riding personal electric vehicles like these one wheels and electric unicycles? Because they fascinate, amaze, and captivate me. They give me purpose, and that makes me feel alive. <laughs> As adults, we get stuck in routines and we stop finding ways to being fascinated. Kids, though, are fascinated by just about everything because everything is new, a learning experience, an exploration and discovery as they look forward to the next new wonder. This is cool. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, that was sweet. I love that. All right, I switched it up a little bit. Evie's on the EUC. I'm on the one wheel. Woo. I find that when I stop exploring and learning, I lose my wonder and fascination with the world. I get stuck in a routine and have nothing to look forward to. And that is when days feel like years and years feel like days. During our stay in Hawaii, I was talking to an older fellow named Bernie, a longtime resident of Oahu's North Shore, asking him about things to do on this part of the island. I asked Bernie how much time I should plan for a recommended outing that we had scheduled and his response caught me by surprise. Stop trying to be so efficient. You're on vacation, you're in Hawaii. Just go and be amazed. So here I am at a favorite local spot, just finding fascination with every road, hill, forest, and beach. Not to mention the fact that I'm riding a single-wheeled, self-balancing electric device with a group of guys that are also on the same type of devices just fascinating this is so cool like it's a mountain bike park in the jungle it's a jungle bike park Woo! and while my life is more than half over continually searching for ways to be amazed will help me slow down time so i can enjoy more of the ride on my birthday and at the start of a new year, I want to thank those who have made this journey so fascinating. Thanks to all the Hawaii riders who treat us like family, loaning me and my family wheels to ride and for taking care of us each time we visit. Thanks to all the amazing companies that have supported the channel. Thanks to you, my amazing YouTube subscribers for your viewership, likes and comments. Thanks to our amazing team, Andrew with his amazing endless energy and optimism and Harry with his quiet behind the scenes hard work and to my amazing family my children and my supportive wife thanks for putting up with me and my passion for pevs and youtube i want to keep finding ways to be fascinated and amazed but i also realize that life isn't about riding the latest and greatest one wheel or euc it's not about having more stuff what it is about is finding fascination and purpose in what you have your surroundings, and your friends and loved ones so you can stay freshly charged. Ah! <laughs> the Peter Griffin. Primal Rage! Ah! Ah! We can oh. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, is this why it's called the Magic School Bus? Yeah. Dude, yeah. the first time we, the first, the first ride on the island, I come and follow these guys, right? <laughs> and this is where they take me, and I'm like, yo, my mind is blown. I get to this point, and they, nobody tells you you're gonna see the bus 13 times. I just, I lost them and I would keep going and I just trail around. I kept past the bus. I said, man, 
I, I'm lost. <laughs> he keeps circling around. He keeps seeing the same bus. It's a magic, it's a school, magic bus. school bus. I promise. Bus, yeah. There's the bus. We had a great time riding with the Hawaii PEV crew, and we're going to be heading out to the car so we can go catch up with the family, uh, spend some time on the beach. That's how you find new places. That's how you explore. Hang out with the locals. They'll show you where to ride. My lucky day. So Randy was nice enough to let me borrow his electric unicycle so I'll have something to ride around while I'm here on the island. Perfect day. And now I get to take this baby and come ride whatever I want.